Introducing the world's first, all-new 2023 Toyota Fortuner. Do you like the aggressive-looking front fascia on the top-of-the-line Toyota Fortuner? If so, consider yourself lucky, because this might be the last Fortuner face we see in our market for a while. Featuring a frame foundation, four-wheel drive, a reduction gear, and a potent turbo diesel, the Toyota Fortuner is a true off-road vehicle. Such vehicles are typically purchased once and for all. However, this does not rule out the requirement for a foreseen upgrade to the model. The Toyota Fortuner for the market underwent a planned update that changed a number of elements. Fortuner is a vehicle that can be used for a variety of purposes. Fortuner is difficult to match because it is robust, roomy, adaptable, and has proven off-road prowess. The Toyota Fortuner will soon see considerable mechanical upgrades. According to the source, the next generation Fortuner would be built on Toyota's TNGAF platform and have a new diesel engine with a mild hybrid system. The Fortuner is currently available in the Philippines in all of its trims, including the V, Q, and LTD versions. Each model has a four-cylinder turbo diesel engine with a displacement of 2.4 or 2.8 liters. The 2.8-liter 1GD FTV, which produces 201 horsepower and 500 newton meters of torque, is paired with an automatic transmission and is standard equipment in all high-specs cars. In terms of performance and design, the Toyota Fortuner has advanced significantly. The new Fortuner receives some premium features within the cabin, in addition to a beautiful and modern design over the previous model. With its generous amount of inside space, the Fortuner provides its passengers with a comfortable ride thanks to features like power-adjustable leather seats and automatic air conditioning with rear AC vents. For the Toyota Hilux and Toyota Land Cruiser Prado, a hybrid diesel engine was reportedly being developed by Toyota. The source originated in Japan. The Fortuner will reportedly get the new powertrain as well, according to the Indian source. Previously, only the Hilux and the Prado had been mentioned. The Japanese source claims that Toyota's diesel-powered SUVs and pickup trucks would be powered by a 2.5-liter diesel-electric hybrid powertrain. Now that the Indian source has provided some additional information, it is clear that the hybrid system will be of the mild sort, much like the Suzuki is doing with its Ertiga and XL7 models. A start-stop system, rapid torque delivery, and regenerative braking are additional aspects of the mild hybrid powertrain in addition to an integrated starter generator or ISG, which is a common component of hybrid systems. The new Fortuner is expected to arrive in Thailand in 2023, in addition to the mild hybrid system, and it will have a wheelbase and length of 2,850 mm and 4,180 mm, respectively. The upgrade will also have a fresh appearance. The automobile has a long list of amenities included. These features include a power driver's seat, dual-zone automatic climate control, ambient lighting, map lights, a multi-function tilt adjustable steering wheel with audio control, a 9-inch touchscreen infotainment system with Bluetooth, Apple CarPlay and Android Auto, a six-speaker audio system, keyless push-button start, automatic headlamps, front and rear parking sensors, a reverse camera, an analog instrument cluster with electroluminescent displays, and adaptive cruise control. The radiator grille has altered dramatically, the LED lights have gotten even sharper, and the front bumper's form has been revised. The addition of new 18 and 20-inch wheels gives the vehicle a robust upscale appearance. The multi-axis spokes and super chrome metallic high-intensity coating finishes reflect this. Black glossy trim features first emerged on the VX2 and VX3 and on more expensive trim levels. The roof can be painted in a color that contrasts the body color. The integration of patented safety systems TSS is the biggest technical change and it's short for Toyota Safety Sense. It's noteworthy that the selection even features a sporty Toyota Fortuner GR Sport variant. The latter has an original interior with GR insignia and black and red trim, as well as a sporty exterior. When one thinks of a Fortuner, one doesn't typically picture a fantastic cabin, yet its flowing lines challenge preconceived notions of the Toyota's interior. One standout is the instrument cluster with its sizable multicolor info display. Push-button start and upgraded smart entry system have been standard across the whole lineup. The Fortuner's 2.8-liter engine has dual-zone climate control at the top end. Additionally, the XV variant sports a high-end JBL audio system. No space is an issue either. Although the Lynx seats in the back can be irritating as you try to maximize storage space, golf bags and luggage fit snugly. The 2.8-liter diesel engine offers a powerful torque of 500 newton meters and performs effectively both on and off-road. The brand new Toyota Fortuner Mild Hybrid is anticipated to provide improved fuel economy and more torque than needed. When it comes to controlling engine braking and pressure, the Downhill Assist Control, or DAC, does an excellent job. Between 3,000 and 3,400 RPM, the 2.8-liter turbo diesel engine generates 150 kilowatts of power. 
the 2.8 GD6 only comes with 6-speed automatic paddle shift transmission, which is noteworthy, but a 4x4 or rear-wheel drive version is also offered. The 2.4 GD6 engine is the Fortuner's mid-range engine. This 2.4-liter .4 four-cylinder turbo diesel engine can generate 110 kilowatts and 400 newton meters of torque. The new Fortuner's mild hybrid technology allows it to store kinetic energy during braking or deceleration, which it can then use to generate extra torque when accelerating. The new model is anticipated to have more power and torque in addition to better fuel economy. For all variations, all Fortuner cars will be equipped with a driver, front passenger, and knee airbag. The highest trim level, the LTD, adds the driver, front passenger, side, curtain shield, and knee airbags, increasing the total to seven. Toyota also included Toyota Safety Sense in the LTD grades, which includes Lane Departure Alert, Adaptive Cruise Control, and Pre-Collision Warning System. Other safety features include child lock doors, the Toyota Vehicle Security System, an engine immobilizer, a horn, ABS and EBD and brake assist, vehicle stability control, traction control, hill start assist control, downhill assist control for the 4x4 LTD, three-point seatbelt for all occupants, driver and front passenger seatbelt reminders, and ISO-fix child seat anchors. The Fortuner has received a lot of new technological features since the vehicle underwent a makeover, making the mid-sized SUV really contemporary and ready to compete with its class rivals. All models come standard with 7 or 8-inch touchscreen infotainment systems from Toyota that supports Apple CarPlay and Android Auto. The backup camera is standard on Fortuner G models. However, Toyota's panoramic view camera is only available on Fortuner V variations and upward. The Fortuner's top-tier trims will come equipped with a 9-speaker JBL audio system to improve your listening experience. The one exception is that proximity sensors will come standard on all models. Keyless entry with push start is standard feature for V variations and above models, along with automated climate control, cruise control, and wireless charging and USB ports. With its exceptional performance, the Fortuner can achieve any objective, whether it is touring, towing, or trekking. Both of the Toyota Fortuner's robust and long-lasting engines, a 2.7-liter four-cylinder option or a 4.0-liter V6 four-wheel drive with 234 horsepower and 376 newton meters of torque, are coupled to a six-speed automatic transmission with part-time 4x4 that can be engaged or disengaged in response to your needs. You may pick your journey with the flexibility needed to handle any road surface, thanks to the 80-liter tank's greatest torque and power. To put it succinctly, the Fortuner is a fully functional car with a sophisticated cruise control feature that is ready to take the lead. Final thoughts. Since the Fortuner is more at home in the woods than it is in the concrete jungle, buying one suggests you probably have a sincere interest in off-road driving. Because it is not a true off-road vehicle except some bumps, the power steering pump with variable flow is made to help at slower speeds. In conclusion, it comes as no surprise that this car will continue to be a top seller for a very long time. Although it is very likely that Toyota is working on a hybrid for one of its popular SUVs, the exact release date is uncertain. Although nothing is definite as of now, we might get a mid-cycle update that adds additional Fortuner variations. With that, we have come to the end of the video. Thank you for watching, and guys, don't forget to subscribe to our channel and also press the bell icon so you can watch our upcoming videos. Also, share your thoughts in the comment box.